Welcome again to another episode of Northeast 360 here on the collapsible table. Uh, this one here is about cases. Uh, we are going to have a few episodes of us taking trips. Uh, we have two pretty decent sized trips. Uh, one to National Forest up in uh, New Hampshire. Uh, and that'll be a several day trip. And sometime in July, we're going to have another one going up to uh, a fundraiser that I do, uh, Swim with a Mission. Uh, usually I swim uh, a 1K. Uh, this year, due to health reasons, uh, I can't swim it. Um, but we will be up there supporting some good guys, Navy SEALs. Uh, good time. If you're in the Northeast area and you see this and it makes an impression, please donate. Go up, see. It's a great time. Uh, I'll leave a link to that in the uh, description. But today is electronics. It's a little bit of that. Um, but really storage cases. And these storage cases that I have in front of you are Pelican alternatives. Meaning Pelican cases are excellent. They're hardcore. They're super duty. You can toss them off a mountain and they just seem like you can keep them going. Well, not everybody can afford Pelican cases, right? Those are those hard military approved cases. Well, guess what? There is an alternative. Uh, these are the Apache. You have the Apache 4800 uh, and the Apache, uh, what was it? Uh, 3800 series cases here. Uh, there are a few others. There's one that's even larger. They also make uh, a gun case setup as well. These are all uh, flight approved. They have little nozzles and on them to, you know, say you need camera equipment, you got to take them on a flight. Um, they won't over expand, under expand. They, with these shut, they will float in water. Uh, they are excellent cases. They're rock solid. I've had one of these drop off a root rack smash on the ground at speed and not have any problems other than a few scrapes up. Uh, excellent cases. They keep everything in them extremely secure. Uh, they have uh, the pickable foam inside of them. Uh, they're excellent for uh, camera equipment like this one to do all my camera equipment as you'll see now. It's not just camera equipment. You'll see what I have done. Uh, it opens up because there's a few manuals back there. But I keep all my GoPro filming equipment in here. I keep two GoPros. I have a GoPro 8. I have a GoPro 7 that fits in here as well. You know, all little gizmos. You know, kind of geeky that way. I, I do a lot of firearms training. I, I like my stuff organized when I go. Uh, it just makes things easier, including filming. But just to show you, yeah, that all fill, fit in here. Uh, I have my tripod, which I'm using currently to film this. But all this, the little, you know, gizmos, attachments, so I can put them on ball mounts, different things like that. Start, stop. Did I have my little cameraman here? I'm waving the camera. That's my son, uh, my eldest. But Alternatively, you can set it up for something like here. This is my general electronics case. So I have everything to film episodes, but underneath, when we're on trips, oops, got that spacer underneath, and this shows you how big this container truly is. We can pull this out. And I have all my communication stuff for when we go off-roading. I can hand out these Midland radios. We'll talk more about communications in another episode of this. But look at how large that is. I can fit all the equipment that goes with these radios, all of the chargers that go with these radios, all of the batteries, including spare batteries, and one, two, three, four, five, six handheld GRMS radios. All with weather band, including my filming equipment inside. 
of this system. Extra batteries for GoPros, gimbals, all of the things that make videos necessary to produce. But think of all the options that you could have. You could have two rows of firearms in here. Uh, say you can't afford a big gun cabinet or a big gun case. You can throw two locks in here, lock this to an unmovable object, and you have a cheap and effective way to store firearms. Uh, you can use this for long trips, stock it up here with food. You don't want your bread crushed. I know it's a little overkill, but literally they can be used for anything, including, you know, you could probably fit yourself a very decent size drone or two. In this case, I would say two DJI's would fit in here with all of its accoutrements perfectly fine, including their respective uh, controllers for here. Um, Utilizing this, I mean, you could put recovery gear in here. I've seen so many different people, and they're stackable. They'll stack on each other. You can interconnect them with locks if you want. They're very versatile cases, but the durability, you can stand on these, just like a Pelican case, for a third of the price. I think uh, I may have even had a coupon at Harbor Freight to get these. Uh, again, I pay for all my equipment. Harbor Freight doesn't sponsor me or do anything of the sort. But with this, when I purchase this, you know, we have inflation now. When I purchase this, and I'll put it in the comments, uh, sorry, not the comments, but the uh, description, a link to these on their online website. I think I picked this one up for 50 bucks. The equivalent Pelican case, which I will put up there, is probably $200. So for a third of the price, outstanding they hold up again fell off the roof of my truck because it got unsecured on a trip it's still together it's got scrapes it's got some dust on it can you put this on the roof of your car you don't need a carrier no you don't as long as you properly strap it down um, and not forget you unstrapped it to get something out of a different case these are hardcore enough that you can leave them on top of your vehicle. I've seen people take these and actually screw through them and make these permanently mounted to their roof racks. These are excellent cases. Now, this is the 40, 4800. Uh, just to break it down, it is IP65 rated uh, for water and dust proofing. Uh, it has pickable foam inside. You can shape it to anything. You can shape it to your firearm. You can shape it to your camera, um, which makes uh, the rattle and shake proofing excellent on this system. Um, it has got an adjustable, as I mentioned, pressure relief valve for taking out on flights. Uh, it has, uh, what do you call it, uh, enhanced padlock areas. So it's not, you're not just cutting the plastic and pulling the padlock off and there you are. Uh, are these impervious? No. But it's it's some quick, you know, assurances involved in it. Uh, the dimensions of this, and I will put it in the video, this is roughly 18 inches by 12 and 7 eighths by 7 and 5 eighths. Again, rock solid. You can see what I put in mine. This one here is my son's. Uh, this is the Apache 3800 series. He keeps his entry-level drone. This is obviously not a DJI, but it is, believe it or not, quite amazing in the quality of the video that it puts out and how it flies. But just to give you a quick view, he could fit two DJI sized drones even in this smaller container this is what I said this is how it comes fully filled in you can pick out pieces I'm not going to pick it out because it's his box but it's pretty cool it keeps every little part battery chargers everything in and again just like on the other one there is a whole nother layer of protection underneath here that you can go pretty deep inside of this. So if you wanted to just put the two drones, the two controllers, and put the batteries on the next level, 
hey, it's up to you. Uh, I just figured I'd show you this up real quick. This is what we use on trips to pack our sensitive equipment. Everything from guns to uh, high-end electronics. Uh, you'll see us using those Midland radios. Um, they're pretty awesome. Uh, it's, a, it's a good peace of mind. But even if you're doing something like, hey, the times are changing. I need an emergency case. This will fit in your, in your car's trunk relatively easy. You can put un, basically an entire survival kit in one of these, having it in your trunk. Water, food, bag to go. Um, you could potentially set yourself up with, you know, they come in all different colors. I'll list the different colors. I believe it's yellow, orange, olive, black, I think beige. Uh, you can set them up for medical kit. You know, you're going on an expedition. You know, say, I want to go here from Massachusetts all the way to uh, Alaska. I want a heavy-duty medical kit with me. I want a heavy-duty recovery kit with me. I've seen people put air compressors in here with all of the tire inflation stuff. Cool, generally. Uh, heavy core, or sorry, hardcore cases that take the abuse. Now, this case here, um, I would definitely suggest this for a drone if it's just going to be drones that you're carrying. If you're going to carry other electronic equipment, like you know, for the 48 series, where you can have two drones and a full case of gear, but this one here, um, again, it's IP65 water uh, and dust resistant or dust proof. Uh, nothing is ever 100% waterproof, but these cases will float. Uh, if I have time, I will try and go by the lake and actually toss one in so you can see it float. Uh, but take it from me, they, they look pretty stock and hardcore. Will they flow forever? No. Um, it's got the pick and pull foam. Uh, it has the pressure relief valve, pre-drilled for the locks, one, two. On this model, you only get two front clips. On the 48, you get extra external clips. You have two side clips, two front clips. It's a little sturdier of a box. Um, the internal dimensions on this one is roughly 14 to in 15 sixteenths by 10 and 9 sixteenths by 6 and 11 sixteenths. As you can see, I mean, this drone here is what we're teaching and training him how to use before I go out and purchase a bigger DJI drone for him to use when we're on these trips. Uh, but it's roughly the same size. Can I fit two DJI drones in here? Absolutely. And by the way, this drone here, pretty fantastic. It will not go as high as a DJI. No. It doesn't have the tracking software as a DJI. But the camera is 1080p. It will go pretty decent, about 150 feet up in the air. Uh, it's not windproof, so you really need a clear, unwindy day. But as a starter drone to get your kids into this, 100 bucks, Costco's. Really? For sure. Uh, I think what? best Christmas gift? Huh? Oh yeah, best Christmas gift ever. So with that said, that's my video uh, for today. It's an awesome quick one. Uh, I, it just, I was pulling some stuff out. I was like, wow, these are just great cases. Let me toss this up on the network so people can see it. 100% uh, rock solid alternative to a Pelican case or the high-end piano cases. I do these all day long. Um, I use them. They're thoroughly used on trips. Uh, they have saved camera equipment, uh, guns uh, from being damaged or destroyed. Uh, they just take the abuse. And I figured, hey, this is worth sharing on the channel today. Um, think preparedness. I mean, you probably see my blue, blue Eddie in there. 
all the things, chargers and stuff like that can go in one of these cases. Uh, a smaller charging unit, solar panels, maybe in the larger 48 case. It's pretty versatile to have your, I don't want to say end of the world, but hey, shit happens. I get a case for it. I get a case for medical. I rolled up on the scene of a major accident that's jammed up the entire highway. We saw one yesterday. The entire highway got jammed up. Hey, I'm a first responder. Could can, Do I have the equipment on me? Um, yes, I did. Um, we didn't have to intervene. By that time, uh, traffic got cleared enough that emergency units got there. But you look out at different places, Montana, uh, even parts of New Hampshire, medical might be a half an hour away. Cases like this save lives. Cases like this where I have communications and we're on camping trips. My wife, kids want to go somewhere. And especially where we're going this year, there's bears, brown, black, coyotes, potentially large cats, small cats, garden cats. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, but I can get a radio and say, hey, guys, it's getting late. Dinner's on. Hey, we're running late. Is dinner on? Communications. Also, compartmentalizing your gear is huge for when I got this weekend off, let's go. I got stuff packed. I'm ready to go. Boom, boom, boom. Car's done. 15 minutes. And the biggest thing is, is when it's compartmentalized, you don't tend to forget things. Whoop. Knocked into the camera there. You don't tend to forget things. So that's my uh, review. Apache, rugged, mobility. Yep, 100%. Uh, Northeast 360 approved. Um, go and get yourself some. You you won't you won't regret it. Uh, so that's it. That's all I got for today. Um, I'll leave links. Uh, please like, share, smash that you know that bell. Keep this channel going. Hopefully one day we can get uh, cooler products sent to us so that we can do an unbiased review of them. All right. Um, even if something is given to me. I run it. I use it. I make sure it's something that we would want in our community of either preparedness or camping or hunting or shooting or general um, life-saving events. Good stuff here. So, as always, this is uh, Christian from Northeast 360. Uh, keep moving forward.